got rain. Y'all. Anyway, today is November 21st, 2021. We ain't here to look at the rain, though. I want to show you something. Look at that. Get the door shut here. That is Trikezilla back on the ground after making some modifications to the frame to fit that Kohler V twin in there. The frame, I don't know if you remember, it used to be slanted. Those bottom twos used to be slanted up higher by five degrees. I cut those, as you know, you just watched it. Lowered it, had to extend the down tube. Um, and now we got the fat front wheel mocked up on here. And oh my God, makes such a huge improvement on this thing. I can't wait to get that back wheels on because they're bigger than those. They're 10 inch wide. And uh, I think they're an inch, maybe two inches taller. Those are just mower wheels for mock up. But uh, look at that. We are in there, man. And there's just enough room for the starter to fit right in there. And yeah, buddy. Uh, <laughs> right when I was welding this back up, I ran out of uh, welding wire on my Lincoln again. So I'm going to have to wait a couple days. I got to get some money and go buy a new spool plus my tank's about empty so anyway yeah check her out sexy the buddy I love that big front wheel that's just so freaking cool but yeah and the engine plates not welded in yet I'm not welding that in until I get my um, torque converter I need to line that up with the rear sprocket so that the chain is riding true and not popping off all the time. But look at that. that is, I can't believe I built this right here in this shop. It's just so freaking awesome. But anyway, we got some mail call and we're going to get to it. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification down below this video. And also, anything in the description, links to other channels, please check them out. They're good guys. Alright, see you in a minute. Alright guys, as you can see, I don't have a whole lot done right now, even still yet, on episode 3 of Trikezilla. Um, I have been working on it hard though. I got, some of these welds are cleaned up now, and... Uh, went back over them again with a weld. I had problems with my welder. It was causing spits and spatters. Uh, two reasons it was doing that is uh, the power company was working on the power grid, changing out a generator or something in my area. And two, my uh, cable lead for my welding wire was real dirty, and I cleaned that out with uh, brake cleaner and then sprayed some WD-40 down in it, and that took care of that. Uh, but uh, nevertheless, yeah, it's coming along pretty good. Still yet, don't have the tank on here yet. Um, I have come up with an idea on how I'm going to weld those brackets on here. Instead of cutting into this, what I'm going to do is cut the brackets in half and weld them on each side, but I gotta mock it all up on here in order to do that, and anyway. Did that just really happen? for the uh, seat bracket. I'm going to make my own and then my own plate 
for right here. <coughs> uh, but overall, 